Hey guys, welcome to this new Road to 100 Dark Sets episode. If this is your first time watching, make sure you click here to see the first episode so you don't miss anything. Hope you enjoyed the newest video. Okay, first fight of the seven episode. Hopefully it goes well. Let's fight Goku. Well, I'm saying first fight, but it's actually the fifth fight I'm doing against my target Goku. And it's it's just so hard to kill him as we pretty much have the same way of die rocking. If we can call that a technique, well, we have the exact same one. And we pretty much never risk when we're not supposed to. So it's extremely hard, hard to kill one another. And I got reset here. And as I just said, he was probably just did probably one of the worst risks. Well, worst misclicks he's ever done. Was probably busy doing something, I hope. Yeah, fifth fifth time we're actually fighting. One of us needs to die, and he will die just now. Wow. I actually feel bad now because he was stalking and I just killed him, but I'll take it, man. Good fight. Okay, we got ourselves a fight against Kanubi. Good luck, man. Let's see how it goes. Did he just... Wow, he just dang that one. Okay. Just realized, actually... No, we'll say it after. No, he thanked it. I forgot to edit my uh, my kill that ratio. I'm actually 40-12 now. I'll, hopefully I'll edit that to 41-12 in the next clip. If Kanubi dies, it would be epic. But anyway, let's try to kill him now. Okay, hit my venge. Wow, please hit the fucking venge, brah. Okay, pot trick. He didn't see that one coming. Good fight, man. Didn't see the pot trick coming. He's probably like, what? Did I have first hit? Nope. Okay, we got ourselves a fight against All Believe in C. Weavy. We'll see how it goes. Thank you. Oh. AGS. Hopefully he has AGS. I don't want three pieces. Okay. He's my friend. Yeah, Goku's not too happy that I'm actually uh, having all the darks fight. Nah, not a Kanubi. Oblivion. Anyway, I should really I really need to stop talking and actually get this done. It's actually the first time I fight Oblivion T Weavy. I know he's oh is he dead? Is he dead? Yeah, he is. Good fight. We'll, we'll take it. 42-12, man. Good fight. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Kanubi. Second time fighting him in this video. Hopefully it goes well. Good luck you too, mate. Thank you. Hit. Okay. Okay, I, I pit hit. Oh, it's both zeros, okay. No, not not the DDS, bro. Please hit my venge. I swear, every time I venge for DDS to hit, it never does. Not a single time. Okay, then the axe I got for set. No, no, I just did. I was like, no, I just didn't do a 50 instead of 60, and he does 72. Rip. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Kanubi, the guy that just landed at 72 on my forehead. It's actually the second time I died to Kanubi. I think I'm 4-2 against Kanubi as we speak. And the both time he killed me was 70 and 72, so he has some pretty good hits. Not today, Kanubi, not today. Die. Of course you would zero I just <laughs> Recoil KO. Well, recoil Venge KO. Good fight, man. Uh, you have been frozen. No. Did I really... Of course, there would be a guy trying to kill me when I'm looting, but he didn't TB me, so. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Walrus, so it goes well. And no to any guy that wants to... Does he have a GS though? No GS. I have a GS though. Hopefully he doesn't mind. Probably has Granite Mole. But yeah, as I was saying, if you're ever trying to PJ someone or kill them for while they're looting, please bring 
teleport blocks, otherwise it's strictly useless. No way you're gonna kill me with just fire edges. You're just gonna waste your runes. Just next time, guy, bring it. Anyway, let's try and kill Walrus now. Oh, I have reset. Oh, good fight, man. 53 for the KO, we'll take it. 44-13 now. Good fight, man. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Uncrushable. Hopefully it goes well. He's my target. And, wow, he could die just now. Wow, the delay was real there. I swear I clicked my axe before. Anyway, hopefully the delay doesn't do anything too bad. It's been lagging a little bit, I must admit. Hopefully I don't DC and lose the AGS. It would be extremely awkward. Okay. Oh, yeah, the Venge. He has no chance of surviving this. AGS for 32. Good fight. On the defense XP, I just realized. Anyway, we'll take it. Good fight. Good old AGS KO. Good luck, man. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Hall Believe and Sea Weavy. Second time fighting this guy in this video, I'm pretty sure. Killed him before. Like, my third kill, I'm pretty sure. Venge up. And we basically opt to world 20 as uh, world 18, the Bounty Hunter world is, is having extremely big disconnection loss problems, so pretty much have to fight in World 20 now. Hopefully it goes well. Did he actually break my Venge? Like, please, hit my Venge. <laughs> I'd like to revenge soon. It's the only thing I sometimes I hate about the arcing. Sometimes you hit 20s and all, and you do 60s with your axes, but most of the time, the, the skimmy hits or whip hits are just zeros, so. Kinda gets lame, and I have reset. What? <laughs> I'll take it, but what the fuck? 57 on 62 HP. Pretty lucky, but I'll take the skill. Good fight. Okay, we got ourselves another fight against Sighted. Good buddy of mine. If you remember, I think it was on episode number 5. This prick actually killed me. With uh, when I was trying to, I did like a six HP risk, and I just didn't have enough time. Well, I misclicked my brew. I wanted to sharp brew Quam one, but I misclicked the brew, and he ended up uh hit hitting a 44 axe right after. So I'm seeking revenge, and he pretty much forced me to bring tentacle whip. I wanted to use AGS as always. I have no. I need to stop talking for real. I forgive you, but I'm pretty much. Oh, he has reset. That would have been so tragic if he killed me after safing. But anyway, like I said, Tentacle Whip, um, I don't mind. And he's dead anyway. Nope, he tanked it. I don't mind using Tentacle Whip. I'd much rather use AGS, but I don't mind. I'm not a dickhead, I hope. He has reset. Nope. Oh, 42. Hit something? Nope. No, I didn't lag. Oh, he had zero. Gmol, please do something. Gmol, good fight, man. 22 Gmol for the KO. We'll take it. Actually, Gmol did a f or first skill of this. Okay, this is what concludes Road to Dark Sets, episode number 7. Hopefully you enjoyed. And as always, I'll finish this video with a quick bank tour. As you can see here, 6 Dark Sets plus the one I'm currently using, which means I have 7 left out of the 20 I bought from the beginning. So it means I died 13 times. Here you can see 47 broken dark sets, which gives me a ratio of 47-13. In this 7th episode, I have a kill death ratio of 8-1. And if you combine the 6th and the 7th uh, episode, I actually have a combined ratio of 15-2. Pretty impressive. I'm really happy with those stats. And if you just saw the last fight I did against Sighted, he said he died because of the lag, but it was a pretty good granite mole switch. I doubt he would have survived any, even without lag, but... I kind of felt bad, so I'll give him 1 million. It's fair play, and we're both happy with the outcome. And if you enjoyed that video, please make sure to give this video a like, and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And hopefully I'll see you back for episode number 8. See ya.